Hello everyone, welcome back to Ellis PDFR. Getting in doing some back-to-back -back episodes today. Uh, we're going to be doing uh, some Blaine County. We'll be using the 2016 Explorer. This is still Maurice 97's uh, 2700 pack. This texture is based off of uh, a county in Ohio. It did not say what county. We'll head over there and take a look at that. It's uh, We got a report of a solid alarm triggered. We're going to head over there. It's right over here. Right up the road here. Wrong button. Right. There we go. Uh, give me just a minute. I gotta set my timer. All right, we're ready to go. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna head over here and see what uh going on with this side alarm call we're getting. How's everyone doing? I hope everyone's enjoying videos. I do apologize for not uploading um, like I want to. I hope before long that's going to change, guys. I don't have the job I used to have. I did uh, quit that job because it was getting stupid. So, going to be finding me something else, a little part-time thing. So I want to spend more time doing this. So. All units, offices on scene. Okay, we've got a person walking right here. And we got a vehicle over here. Let's see if there's anybody in this vehicle. There's not. I want to check this building first. Nobody there. Talk to this dude right here walking in. Hey dude, come here. Hands up, cream pie, right now! What are you doing out here? Let's see some ID, huh? Thanks. Where is ID? He has a uh, suspended license. We're going to see if this is... Alright. Let's talk to this suspect. You own the property. Alright. So he doesn't own the property. So that tells us that he's not supposed to be here. He's going to be going to jail. You're mine now. Attention all units, we've got a suspect placed under arrest. I'm gonna call one backup unit out here since we are, we do have two suspects here. Copy that, we're in the vicinity. Let's see some ID, huh? Thank you. Alright, we're gonna ask him the same question. He's going to say the same thing. So they're both um, not supposed to be here. Attention all units. We have a suspect neutralized. All units. We've got a suspect placed under arrest. Okay, we're going to run this tag. Of this vehicle. Target license plate. Four, five, John, George, Adam, nine, one, one, a possible stolen vehicle. Proceed with caution. A uh, vehicle is stolen. 
had a lock picking kit in it in the trunk. Alright. We're gonna be getting this vehicle out of here. It is stolen. We got backup riding on the scene to help us out. Flatbed, assistance required in Grande Sonora Desert. Alright dude, come on with me. I'm gonna tell the other one to follow us. Stay right there for a minute. Tell him to follow us. Come on. We're going to search the premises after we take care of these two suspects. Take them back to our vehicles and get them secure. He had uh, no hints of any alcohol or any drugs on him. Uh, okay, he had a pair of pencils, a pair of sunglasses, a, a social security card with someone else's name, and a different number on him. Okay. We'll give him a test for drugs. I don't think he's going to have anything on him. Thanks. Yeah, he's fine. Okay. We'll put him in the vehicle. Come on, shut the door. Ah, oh, come on, it get him out. No, don't get him out. Alright, dude, come over here with me. Over here in front of the vehicle. Now we're gonna search you. We'll let our partner search you. He had a meth pipe and a w weapon on him. So we're going to put him in a separate vehicle, in our partner's vehicle here. So they're separated. Alright, we're going to search the rest, the rest of the premises. Both of them are secure, so we're going to be looking for evidence. Let's look around here. This is neat. I've never been to a burglary call here, so this is something new. Mm -hmm. Now what we have to do, guys, we got to find the evidence. You know, it could be a duffel bag, it could be a, in a suitcase, it could be in, um, it could be anywhere, too. You know, that's, that's the thing, so we're just kind of looking around all the areas here. I mean, technically, right now, with no evidence, we can't charge them with burglary. 
We could charge them with trespassing, but we, we can't charge them with burglary because we can't, we don't have no evidence that they are, they have broke into the place, that they're stealing anything. So that's why we're walking around. So if we see anything. We got something right here. Where's it at? The next area popped up. Yeah, there's some money there. Got some money. So we did find some money. Some cash. Okay. I walk around this car over here. Yeah, nothing in this area. Just kind of searching it. Just making sure there's nothing else here. Don't know if we have enough evidence, you know. I don't know what I'm going to make because, you know, really and truly that could be anyone's money, you know. That's, um... Leave Mark up in this bus here, why not? Just... Just make sure they didn't put anything in there. You never know. Yeah, so we did find some money. Right now I haven't found anything else. Still got a little bit to search for. Let's search this building here. You know, like we say, you know, technically, I mean, we did find some money, and they are on the property, but we, you know, we don't have any other evidence that they burglarized the building. I mean, that, you know, that could have been anyone's money. They were dropped. There's some bags here, but I think that's just, you know, normal. GTA stuff. I don't want to go too far. Our vehicle may disappear. Well, I want to say that that may be it because I haven't seen anything else. So we're going to say that that's it. So we're going to write them up for burglary. We're going to call them with the call and see what it says. All units, we are code 4. We did find all the evidence. Okay, so 
What we're gonna do is we're gonna write them up now for burger. So both of them is gonna get charged for it. They was both on the premises. Okay. And he's going to be charged for it. All right. They're both going to go in for burglary. I need to get him out of this vehicle because they'll, um, chances are that he won't take him. So I'm gonna move him over here. Hey. Assistance needed on need um Cat Claw Avenue. Did not work. Assistance required Hello. on um Cat Claw Avenue. He worked then. You asshole. He's gonna take him. Normally he don't. Normally they take the one that's in my vehicle, so yeah. And they're gonna pick up the other one. Let me move my vehicle over here. So we're done here. So how's everyone doing? I hope everyone's staying safe for all the things going on. So we're gonna go down and swing by through Sandy Shores, see if anything's going on in Sandy Shores. We're gonna turn on that vehicle. Suspect in it has no license. Attention, 
Lincoln Unit 1, Lincoln 18. We've got a code 99 on Marina Drive. I can get them over up some more. Get them up and pass that rock. Come on. Come on, get past the rock. There you go. Don't hit the pole. That's good. Alright, I'm running the tag. Suspect's license plate. Zero three, Sam, Victor, Zebra, zero six, four, a traffic violation. Proceed with caution. Alright, we'll get out and talk to him about not having no license. How's it going, ma'am? We're uh, with the Blaine County Sheriff's Department here. This is uh, Deputy uh, Burnett with the Blaine County Sheriff's Department. We why we stop you because you have no license. So we're going to get the ID. Let's yeah. see some ID, huh? We're going to ask about the license. She lost her license, okay. We just sit tight, let me see what we can do here. Well, I mean, she only has one. She had a uh, brandishing a weapon on the roadside. She had a ticket for that. I'm going to see if we can get her for... I do believe it's a restful offense. That's why I'm looking. Well, you can't give her a citation, so I think we're going to do that this time. Her license are not revoked, but we're going to give her one for failing, uh, failure to present driver license. Alright ma'am, we're going to be cutting you a break today. I'm going to issue a citation today um, for failure to um, present your driver's license because you said you lost them. But you need to get that, get that took care of as soon as possible. Alright, there you go. Have a good afternoon. That vehicle there says it's stolen. In Sandy Shores. Roger, we're heading over now. What are they doing? Now they're following me. Okay, I don't know why it does that. But they want to follow me, that's fine. We'll stop them right here. Been kind of quiet up here in Blaine County today. 
Pacific license plate. Six zero Henry David Union two six eight. Stolen with no insurance. A traffic violation. Proceed with caution. Ah, uh, they cancel the trap stop. What is that? Hit the button we normally hit and for some reason it popped the van up. What is it? Okay. I don't know what it's doing. I'm trying to get them off the road and it's uh, spawning vehicles. I don't know what that was. Let me get rid of these vehicles real quick. I don't know why I didn't spawn them. Flatbed, assistance needed on Panorama Drive. Flatbed, assistance required on Panorama Drive. Alright. Hello, sir. With the Blaine County Sheriff's Department, he's while we stopped you, this vehicle has been reported stolen. Let's see some ID, huh? The driver is sweaty. Thank you. nervous and sweaty okay so when I asked him about the vehicle does he own the vehicle he said he borrowed it he said it's his mom's car okay I'm gonna check it out Well, uh, it's not his mom's car. Okay, it has been reported stolen by this person here. Yeah, I'm gonna get a backup unit down here. Backup required on, um, Panorama Drive. Just in case. Roger, we're heading over now. Alright sir, unfortunately the vehicle has been reported stolen, so you're gonna step out of the vehicle. Wait a sec, buddy. You're mine now. Go ahead, I'll cover you. In Sandy Shores. Searching. This is Ocean One. We can get that. He had a bottle of pills, a revolver magazine for forty five rounds. A fake San Andreas Park Ranger badge. Not testing any narcotics.
Thanks. He's positive for cocaine. Thank you. No alcohol in huh? So he's going in for a lot of charges. He had drugs on him. He had um, a fake park ranger badge. I'm going to search this vehicle and get it out of here. Enough entries on the driver's side, enough entries on the passenger side. In the trunk, he had a three handbags, a right card wallet, and a grenade. Flatbed, assistance needed on a panorama drive. All right, I'll write up his paperwork. So it's been kind of a quiet patrol up here in Blaine County today. So he's going to be going in for, uh, yeah, well. Be going in for possession of a stolen vehicle. He got a grenade on him, so we're gonna get him for that possession of a explosive device. Coke on him. I guess all I was going to get him for. Alright. I'm going to get her to take him in. You want me to handle the transport? You want to handle it. Okay. Assistance needed in Grande Sonora Desert. Oh, the fog's rolled in. And he shut my door. Yeah, there we go. Alright. We're done with that. We've got a person with a firearm. A criminal resisting arrest on, um, Joshua Road. We got a report of a person with firearm resisting arrest. Code 3. Requesting air support over Sandy Shores. We're over the area. Engaging suspect. Air support. Suspect is heading east. Backup needed on um smoke tree road. Copy that dispatch. Animals on the loose. Adam six. Copy. We'll check it out. Oh, this thing got a break. I'm going to take that mod out. I see the perp. We're in pursuit.
out of the car. LSPD, do you move? Gonna hunt you down. We've got you surrounded. End of the road for you, pal. I'm gonna take that hand of mine out. That that's bad. You're under arrest, dumbass. Ain't got no brakes. Los Santos County come out of here. Get in the car, quit hitting there. I'm gonna call one backup unit out here. Assistance required on a panorama drive. Roger, we're heading over now. He had a fake ID on him. Yo, thanks. All right, let him go in the car. Oh, we're starting to lose some textures. I don't know why I'm spawning that, it shouldn't be. Uh, crap. He had a, uh, a pistol, a handcuffs, a hunting knife, candy, bar, loose change on him. He, he has a warrant. Why is it not putting them in the car? Search this vehicle. Uh, enough interest on the driver's side. The passenger had a six-pack of E-Color cans, several unopened bottles of AMM beer in the trunk. Enough of interest. Hold on. Before we do that, I want to do this. I don't know why we're losing textures like we are. Alright. Alright, now we'll get it out of here. Needed in uh, Grande Sonora Desert. 
why did it not? So let's write up their paperwork. This guy here, he had a warrant. So he's going in for his warrant. He also had a pistol on him, so he'll be charged with that. Session of a legal weapon. He's going to be charged with moving violation for reckless driving. Fleeing from police. So that one's done. We're going to charge him with, um, I don't know if there is a spot for this. For a fake ID. I'm going to say, let's see, fake driver's license, stolen driver license. I'm just going to say stolen property because there's not a spot. Or fake ID in here, I don't think. I'll have to look at that. Alright. And since our timer is up, we're gonna go ahead and release this guy. We're gonna take them to the station or so. Thank you. Ah, oh, come on. Get back in the car. Yeah, I never got to remove that handle line that I got in here because I don't like it because these vehicles can't stop. The steering is terrible with them with that handle line. Alright, we're gonna get another officer to take him in. Alright guys, that's going to be it for the video of the day. I'm going to get in here and do another video here. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Have a good day.